Hello, I'm Matt and welcome to Badge Workshop. I've had this metal ring sitting around the shop for ages now and I thought I'm going to turn it into a clock. So let's get started. I'm on a mission at the moment to really sort out the workshop so I scoured my shelves for things I could use up. I'd kept many jars and bottles of stains with only a tiny bit left in them, not enough to do a project. So I ripped down loads of pallet wood to some random widths. I arranged these pieces in an alternating pattern and then just made sure the ring would actually fit. Lucky I cut just enough, so I gave everything a quick sand down before moving on to staining. There really were any dribbles left in these tins, but I always hold on to them in case something I've made gets damaged and needs a little touch up. Sometimes you just gotta let things go. I arranged it all so it looked like a random selection of widths and colours. Then all the pieces could be glued together. I clamped it all up and left it to dry. This gave me some time to think about how I was going to cut the circle out. My initial plan was to use the bandsaw, but I'd just got a router so I thought I'd give that a go. By mounting the router on a piece of MDF and then screwing the MDF to the centre of the circle I wanted to cut, I could make several passes to cut it out. As this is only going to be a clock and not get much wear and tear, I was just going to attach the metal ring with some epoxy. Originally I thought about having the wood go inside the ring, but I really wanted the ring to protrude up more. I went for gluing it on the top, and I think it'd be strong enough. When it all dried, I gave it a quick sand to make sure the wood and metal all flush with each other. The one thing I had to buy for this project was the clock mechanism. And I had to actually do quite a lot of searching online to find one with a long spindle to fit through the thickness of the pallet wood. But the actual installation of it is incredibly simple. And that's it all done. I'm pleased with the look of it and it used up lots of materials. Thanks for watching and please subscribe for more videos.